Homo habilis, Homo erectus, Homo sapien, and Australopithecus afarensis. Mm. Nice. I might give you a quiz about that at the end. <laughs> <laughs> it is 55 kilometers in length with a division of two branches, which forms a Y letter form. The main gorge starts at Lake Ndutu, 35 kilometers away from the western side. The side gorge starts at Laitoli, 45 kilometers away from the southern side. Both the branches join behind the earth pillar in front of us, and the gorge ends on the Orbabal Depression on the foothill of Romoti Mountain to the east, some 20 kilometers from here. From the neighboring Vulcan Highlands, that the basement of the Old Pai Gorge and the two million years ago. The dating is by radioactive potassium argon 40. Above the black there are five stratas or layers which are termed as the Old Pai geological beds. The gray sediment above the black two meters from the floor is the first strata. Below the right of the pillar in front of us is the second strata. The red is the third. The fourth layer is the gray on top of the red on the cliff, and uh, this is the fifth, where we are. Mm -hmm. Two different kinds of hominids were found in the first strata, and that means they were living contemporaneously. The first found, which was found by Dr. Mary Leakey in 1959, was Australopithecus boise, or Zingeanthropus with a surgical crest and a massive jaw, large thick teeth, to enable himself to grind hard seeds, for he was a vegetarian that only, and that's how he was nicknamed Nutcracker Man. <laughs> the other one is Homo habilis, a man with ability of using hands and made the first the primitive tools, nicknamed Handy Man. <laughs> and, both of, and both of them are dated back to 1.8 million years ago. Erectus from the second layer. He stood fully upright and made better tools and is one and a half million years ago. The red one is different. Nothing much known there because it was too dry to support light. But the fourth layer Homo erectus found again dated back to 400,000 years ago. And the fifth strata Homo sapiens found Data back to 17 thousand years before Christ. In 1978, Dr. Mary Leakey found the hominid <coughs> footprints at Laitoli, where the branch of the gorge start from the south. They belong to the species known as Australopithecus afarensis, dated back to 3.6 million years ago. They are the same species with a skeleton nicknamed Lucy, which was found in Ethiopia. 1974, by Professor Tim White from the Department of Paleontology at the University of California at Berkeley. But the name Lucy was only given to the skeleton simply because during that day the scientists were listening and dancing the Beatles song Lucy in the Sky with them. <laughs> <laughs> in 1905 August, we had a joint expedition, Tanzanian scientists with Americans from the State University of New Jersey at Rutgers found the maxilla of Homo habilis dated back to 1.8 million years ago. Excavation is, is going on down there in every July, August, September because there are still a lot to be found in the deposit. The proper name of the gorge is Old Pi and not Old Vi. It is a Maasai name for this plant. Wild Sisology grows in the gorge. Scientifically, it's known as San Saveria Hebriana. The Maasai make crops and strings for sorting the bit from this fiber. Professor Liki made the Pai Gorge world famous, who was the son of a British missionary born in Kenya, saw the remains from Old Pai at the first time in the Berlin Museum, and that's how he came and worked here. Here we are. Site work. The strata. The first layer ends on the tough line over there. Those are datable volcanic ash, which separate them. Above Z2, bed 4 and 5 can be seen way over that cliff. Mm -hmm. This was all excavated. The pile of soil, much of it have been washed away by working over there, came from here, was dumped from here.
This was all covered up to this level and Mary Lick found that scar exactly in this spot. The name Australopithecus means southern ape. Boise was the first financial supporter of the league. He's named Charles Boise, who raised the boys from Oxford. He financed the league from 1931 on the first came here to 1959 when she found the scar. Thereafter, National Geographic Society from Washington, D.C. decided to finance them. Zinj and Thropas are two words which combine together. Zinj, ancient Arabic word for East Africa, and Anthropus, the Greek word for man. There are fossils of different kind of animal here. It's a small part of a vertebrate of a prehistoric giraffe, if you like to pass it around. Ni hip socket of a prehistoric elephant. It's not fossilized, it's lighter. If you hit it, it sounds like a wood because it's not fossilized. And if you hit it, it sounds like iron because of fossilization, attracting and absorbing a lot of minerals. Like this. Oh, mm -hmm. Unlike the other ones. So